it is time for the 404 challenge. We are playing on hard mode to be extra cool. And here we go. You, what you do is you create a new world. And for the seed, you give it the number 404. The reason is, is the world is pretty special. Most particularly, there is a sinkhole. Which we're going to be using as part of the, I mean, that is the challenge, is to go down the sinkhole. So let's find it. It's at negative 27, 23. Which is around here somewhere. Up this way. Which shouldn't be too far off. Anyway, we have to gather supplies. Okay, sinkhole's gonna be up this way. Which means it should be up this way. Over there it is. Yep. Okay, we've got to gather as many supplies as possible. Because when night comes, we're going down the sinkhole and we're never coming back up. So we especially want to collect things that we will not be able to get again once we're down there. Like bacon. We'll need saplings so we can make an underground tree farm. We also need some wood just to get going. So let's make stuff. I need a crafting table. Really quick. We need sticks. We need more wood. This is taking so much time. Okay. Here we go. I tried this challenge once before, but when I was going down the sinkhole, I got killed by a creeper. Hopefully that won't happen again. Because there really isn't much way to avoid that. Okay, we need stone for some tools we're going to need. We're not getting much. Okay, we're going to need... Actually, I know what that can wait. Axe. Shovel. Sword. Okay, and we're taking this with us. Okay, let's gather all the wood from this tree. That should be all we need. When we come back, there should be saplings laying on the ground. We already have plenty, but anyway. Where are we? We're going for the reed. Which is at negative seven. You know what? Let's go for the pumpkins. Yeah. The pumpkins are at going to want to hit a few sheep because we need wool if we're ever going to build a bed down there. Come on, jump. 
jump Minecraft and jump. Okay, the reason I'm going here this way without checking coordinate. No, woo. Okay, we just about lost a lot of health, which would have really hurt us in the long run. Okay, mushrooms. That's the reason I came this way. Okay. We're going to 150, 79. 150 is this way, 79 is this way. Of course, we can't resist hitting a few sheep. Rose, we're going to need that. More mushrooms. We're totally going to need those. Okay, we can now make mushroom stew, which is going to be one of our main sources of health down there. Okay. We're at 150. 79 is this way. The pumpkins will be on top of a mountain. Okay, we're at midday. We're doing okay. Yep, here's the pumpkins. And there are quite a few of them. Once we're down there, we're not going to be able to use torches. We're going to be using lava. We can also use redstone torches and jack-o'-lanterns. I mean, you need a torch to make a jack-o'-lantern, but you can make a torch just to put it in a jack-o'-lantern. Torches themselves, we cannot, we cannot just stick to walls. Okay. We're going this way for the reed, which is at negative 70, 128. Also going to need to pick up some sand. Whew. We're doing good. I just hope a creeper doesn't kill me as soon as I step foot in the sinkhole. So we're playing on hard mode, and if that hits me, that's going to kill me. Okay, now we're headed back to the sinkhole, which is at negative 27, 23. This guy swims so slow. Yeah, we're gonna need sand for one well, of the challenges within the challenge. sand. Because we're never going to see sand again. Well, possibly. But gravel and dirt are going to be the more common ones. Yeah. 
Okay, good enough. Let's go collect those saplings. And then we'll do trees until we until it turns dark. One of the other sub challenges is to never wall yourself into where enemies cannot possibly get. That is going to be really horrid. Okay. Let's go down there and let's just see if I survive. I think we've got everything. So down we go into horrible land. I got my sword out. That sound was just exactly what I'm looking for. We're going down. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, we're going over here. Now, do realize enemies can get around to me if they want. But I haven't completely walled myself in. So we're good. Okay, I'm cutting the video here. We will continue the challenge in a bit. See ya.